What we're going to do today is talk about using eye tree canopy to determine the percent tree cover, shrubs, pavement, and so forth. And the way to do that is go to www.itreetools.org, go to Applications, and then go to Canopy. And it opens up this little file. And it works in conjunction with uh, Google Earth. So they want us to load S3 shapefile. And we, you browse to where your shapefile files are. And in this case, it was in the Bronx. And you have to go into the details because they want a particular, particular one. And uh, what I also have to do is uh, find out the most recent one. And what I did was four areas of the Bronx. And they want the SHP file. They don't want the actual shape file. They just want that one. So you click on that and say open and say OK. And you see now it goes to that area of the Bronx where and they kind of graze out the stuff that you're not going to use. And then what you do is configure this survey. So what they have, they have tree and non-tree. Well, tree. We're going to take non-tree and put it in the garbage basket. And then we're going to add new types. So I'm going to make a uh, shrub, SB, and you submit that. So these are all the categories. And we say, then when we get them all in there, we say done. And now you want to begin Ike Tree Canopy Survey. And what it, OK, that is the tree, yes. That is that is a tree. I'm going to call that a tree. Going to be called because that's a baby tree. That could be one of our new baby trees. That's parking, uh, parking lot, and you just do these little positives. That's a building. Um, the more you do, the the smaller maybe the error bars will be. Um, I forget what SB was. Shrub, shrub. Oh. Oh, there's another tree. So um, that's pretty much it. And then when you want to do, you can save your data and uh, save it someplace. Full view. I'll save it in full view. Whoops. No. No. Uh, canopy Bronx. What you can do is make reports. And the reports will come out nicely. Now, there are those who can figure out how to make this print, but I myself can't. So what I do in my simplicity is I use screenshot. Take a screenshot of this, and uh, it's super.